down. Let go! My... I said let go! My purse! Hey. Oh, I didn't know Spider-Man was... Was what? So young? So cute? Nice haircut? So full of riz? Oh. Then what is it? You didn't know Spider-Man was what? I was gonna say... Back up! <laughs> Am I supposed to be scared of this thing? I didn't even ask you for help. Get lost. The kid thinks he's a superhero. What a joke. You're struggling with the bag of chips? Look, look. Green Goblin hits another bag. And no Moose Wayne. Can you believe that? Where's he at? But look at that. Could you imagine having your picture in the paper? In the paper? That'd be a dream. Look, I wouldn't be bothered by the bank robberies, honestly. I heard he only steals from, like, rich people. Peter? Peter! Yeah, what's up? You're never gonna get anywhere if you don't talk to her. Yeah, I don't, I'll talk to her when I'm ready. I don't, you don't wanna rush these things. Oh, come on, man. The Halloween dance is tomorrow night. It's your perfect opportunity to ask Mary. Don't be scared. Scared? Scared? Me? <laughs> I'm not scared of anything. Yes! It was a uh, spider. A spider. Big one. You see the irony, right? I'm gonna go talk to her. Okay. Godspeed. Hey, Mary! No, no. Hey, Mary. That's too deep. Hey, Mary, I was- no. oh. <laughs> You just spilled my protein shake. Mm -hmm. My bad, Butch. I, I, f I feel bad. Yeah, you I should. But you can't see where you're walking, huh? You ain't looking forward when you're walking forward. Oh, Butch, check it out. Oh. So you dressing up as Spider-Man for Halloween, huh? Because what are you, eight years old? I'm not dressing up as Spider-Man. I am Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you, you think you're Spider-Man? Okay, all right. You Spider-Man, huh? Let's test out these spidey senses. Dodge this! Wait! Butch, don't be a bully. Let's go. Come on, doll. You know we just having some fun. Not at Peter's expense. Let's go. This ain't over. Yeah, he said. You okay? <clears throat> I didn't know Mary's dating Butch. This day just keeps getting worse. Come on. I know, I hate this feeling. What feeling? I don't know, the feeling of being a loser. No one. That. Yeah, I can't stand this school. Yeah, but it's not just the school, it's everywhere. It's strangers. They treat me like that too. My parents, they still don't talk to me. I know how much it hurts to be rejected. I mean, you remember when my dad left my mom and I completely blindsided us, and I just felt alone. But if only there was like a way that, I don't know, I could prove myself. Like show people that, that, that I'm not a loser. All this would change. I could prove to people that I am somebody. Ain't that the dream? Do you have faith that the Havenbrook Police Department is going to catch him? If I'm being honest, I don't. 
I feel like this whole city's falling apart and someone needs to bring that green goblin to justice. You mean like Moose Wayne or Feline Fury? Sure, them. Or someone brave, handsome. Hmm. Good hair. Tall. Three to four, it's still good, you know? You know, a real hero who could just turn this town around and save us. That's it? That's it, I stopped the Green Goblin. Wait, wait, you're being serious. If I stop the Green Goblin, people look at me different, like I'm a hero. But he's like a real villain. Listen, I don't need your negativity. I need you to hop on the train. Look, you still got that pizza delivery costume you wore last Halloween? Yeah, why? Follow me, come on, come on. And with Moose Wayne, MIA, a lot of people are saying Chief Wiggins isn't doing enough. What are your thoughts? I assure you, Chief Wiggins is doing all he can. In fact, right now, he's over there, working hard. <clears throat> Any other questions? Yeah, there's a rumor going around that only the high-value safes were stolen from, not average customers. Is this true? Can I help oh. you, kid? Oh, you gotta, like, ease your way into conversation. It's just, ah. can I help you, kid? Yeah. Uh, I'm a, a pizza delivery for Chief Wiggins. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll take it. Ah. No, 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 no. He actually told me to specifically give it straight to him because there's people out there that are very hungry. Yeah, I know those people. <laughs> but I, I, I would never. At least tell me what kind it is. Uh-uh. How about this? Uh, if I guess right, I get a slice. No. Uh, pepperoni. It's pepperoni, isn't wow, it? Wow, you are way off. Listen, let me do my job and give this to Chief Wiggins because he told me that if somebody intercepts this pizza and gives it to him, whoever gives it to him, gonna get fired. And you want your job because you gotta feed your family, your kids, yourself. You, you just, you got a lot to do right now. So let me go give this to the Chief. Okay. All right. Go. Cool. It's for the greater good. Thank you for your service. Okay, let's get straight to business. Would I be fighting? Well, you gonna give me my pizza or not, Chief Wiggins? That's right. Yeah, yeah. This is this is for you. Oh, yeah. You wanna do right. a little trade? Alrighty. The sugar's bad for you. Well. Not so fast. I always check my order. I asked for extra pepperoni. It's only a couple pepperonis on this. Oh, yeah. Well, maybe you, you should lay off the pepperoni. Yeah, we gotta look at our calorie intake. Oh. So you're a nutrition expert, huh? On the weekends. On the weekends. Have a good one. Here, you can uh, use this for your family. I feel bad. Yo, Glenn. I found out who the Green Goblin is. You did? Yeah, I did. The person that owns this cufflink found it at the crime scene. There's probably a thousand places that sell these. Seven, actually, spread out all across the United States. And get this, one of them is right here in Havenbrook. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break in after hours, find the serial number, look up the purchase history of everyone who's ever bought it, and boom, baby, solved. Call me Sherlock. Peter, th this isn't protecting grandmas from low lives trying to seal their purses, that's easy. This is going after someone dangerous. Your powers don't always work. You can't depend on it. You should just let the police handle it. Police? No, that defeats the purpose of me being a hero. I'm doing this on my own, dolo, by myself. What up, loser? What you working on? What, you buying something for your imaginary girlfriend you taking to the dance tonight? Well, why would I need an imaginary girlfriend when I can just take yours? You... <laughs> what did you say? You saved by the bell, okay? If I see you tonight, you ain't gonna be so lucky. 
Oh. Butch, you gotta brush. Just two times a day, one in the morning, one at night. I don't get what Mary's seeing him, but I get what she's smelling him, because woo! That thing's spicy. I heard his poetry is pretty good. It was a trap. What are you talking about? Somehow the Green Goblin knew I was gonna be there. When I got there, it was like gas bombs everywhere. How could he know you were gonna be there? That's what I'm trying to figure out. The only person I told was you, and the only person that was there was... Butch. Butch. He's Spider-Man, huh? All right, let's test out these body senses, shall we? <laughs> I didn't <laughs> fucking do it. I didn't do it. Who is it? Bush, did you just do that to Glenn? I mean, it wasn't meant for him. It was meant for Peter. Why do you have to be such a jerk? Stop. Then answer I me. I said stop. Let her go, Butch. You don't grab a woman. You treat her like a queen. But you don't know nothing about that. You don't deserve her. Thank you, Peter. No one's ever stood up for me that way before. Mary, look, I promise you, if, if you give me a chance, I'll never... Take this! <laughs> Chill out. Peter Barker? Yeah. You're under arrest. No, no, I was, I was defending myself. He attacked me. It's not about that. It's about robbing multiple banks. What? Can you explain yourself? Okay, that's fine with me. See, we got a tip. And look what we found in your locker. Peter. You're Green Goblin. No, I'm... You put that on my locker, but you set me up. Hey, wait a minute. You're the guy from the bank, aren't you? We're probably there trying to conceal evidence. You're going away for a long time, kid. And I thought you were a hero. I am. Yeah, more like a joke. Let's go dance, babe. He's the Green Goblin. Get him out of my school. I'm Spider-Man. Hurry up, kid. Change into this and put all your belongings in the bag. Y'all are wasting time. You gotta let me out of here. I'm telling you, the real Green Goblin's out there. Unless you get 10 grand to make bail, you're going nowhere. 10 grips? Should've gave me a slice of pizza, kiddo. <laughs> no. Wait, what? He's not. You return this here, kid. Hurry up and change. Attorney? Not prescription. I'm guessing by now you figured it out. You ain't getting away with this. I'm telling the police. Didn't you already try to blame Butch? Where'd that get you? <laughs> Don't forget, they found this in your locker. Oh, give me that look. I tried to warn you to back off, but you wouldn't listen. 
You were getting way too close. I couldn't risk it. So you set me up? You don't need to take that tone. I'm not the problem, Peter. Rich people are. Do you want to know why my dad left us? Because his consulting business started actually making money. First taste of it he got, he was gone. Bought a new car, got a new house, a new family. He moved in with his secretary, left my mom and I with nothing. The people that stood by him all his life. That's why I hate rich people. And steal from them. You ain't gotta do this. Yeah, I do. And now, with everyone thinking you're the Green Goblin and Moose Wayne out of the picture, all of it eats off my back. I can steal from more banks. No one can stop me. Certainly not you. By the way, you finally got what you wanted. Your picture in the newspaper. <laughs> Enjoy your stay, Green Goblin. Nice cufflink. <clears throat> nice cufflink. Wait, you're Moose Wayne. What are you doing here? Aren't you the good guy? And you're not? I mean, I was trying to catch the bad guy and then I kind of became the bad guy. I mean, to the public anyway, I got framed. I know the feeling. I count on the cops to clean up this city. And when I realized they wouldn't, I took matters into my own hands. At first, the cops loved me. I was their hero. But then, they started to realize I was doing their job better than them. And they saw me as the villain. So they locked me up didn't tell anybody and just hope nobody noticed. Yeah, but at least in the public's eye, you're still a legend. Me, I'm nothing. Not only am I stuck in here, people see me as a joke. They don't respect me. Is that why you're chasing these bad guys? To prove them wrong? All I ever wanted was to be somebody. Okay, when I was little, my parents left me and no one thought I was worth adopting. So yeah, I thought that maybe if I captured the Green Goblin, the world would look at me different. They would look at me as more than just some abandoned kid. <laughs> I'm sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It was deep. <clears throat> I'm good now. Continue. You need some water? No. Maybe. No. All right, well, as I was saying, like looking, looking back on it, I get it, yeah. Doesn't make any sense, like me having people think that I'm a superhero. Let me tell you something. You don't need superpowers to be a superhero. All you need is to be a good person. And you got that part covered. Well, clearly I don't. Look, I'm, I'm stuck here. I have no, no family, no money, and the whole world thinks I'm the bad guy? Maybe, but if that's true, I think it's time to prove them wrong and show them who you really are, a hero. Even if I wanted to do that, how? I'm stuck here, I'm broke, I don't even have close to $10,000 to post bail. <clears throat> how much is that cufflink? Drop the bags, Glenn. Peter? <laughs> you should have stayed in jail. <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs>
All you'll ever be is a pathetic loser, Peter. Nothing more. <laughs> Sad. I'm gonna have to find someone new to have lunch with. Goodbye, Peter! Just so you know, I had it under control the whole time. You can put your hands down, Spider-Man. We know you're innocent. Right. Look at that. Hey, Peter, look, you're on the front cover. If only you were actually Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> At least you're lucky. Whoever this guy is cleared your name, or else you'd be in jail. Hey, who, who was that guy you were talking to? I told you he's just a friend. No, that's not a joke. Are you serious? Listen, like I told y'all before, that was me. I'm Spider-Man. I'm really him. I'm built like that. <laughs> right. Like someone like you has superpowers. You ain't got to have superpowers to be a superhero. You just gotta be a good person. But you don't know nothing about that, do you? Now move. Yo, Butch, let her go. All right. You know what? Everyone is right about you. You are a joke. So back up before you get... What? Yo, you really wearing cartoon underwear? That's crazy. That's wild. You real wild for that. Y'all, don't, don't just stand to help me. Yo, go. Isn't very go. nice? I had to do what I had to do. Now y'all go clean up his doo-doo. I was wrong about you. You are a hero. So what are you doing after school today? Um, I, after school I am, I gotta uh, see my good friend Moose Wayne help save him. Cause you know, like you said, I am a, uh, Hero. Is that so? Mm-hmm. Maybe you join. Maybe. Maybe. I like those odds. <laughs>